Hello, and welcome to Naptime Videos. My name is Philip, and today you will be learning about the life cycle of Basidiomyces. Alright, well let's get started. The life cycle of the Basidiomyces begins with the Basidium, the sexual reproductive structure of the Basidiomyces. Outside of the Basidium, Basidiospores form. When mature, the Basidiospores are ejected and then dispersed by the wind. In a suitable environment, the Basidiospores germinate and grow into short-lived haploid hyphae slash mycelia. Two haploid hyphae from different mating types then sense each other, grow towards each other, and then undergo plasmogamy, where the two mating types fuse and form a dikaryotic hyphae. Environmental cues, such as rain or change in temperature, induce a dikaryotic mycelium to form compact masses that develop into basidiocarps, which are the fruiting structures of the basidiomycetes and is part of the mushroom we typically see. The basidiocarp is topped with a cap that has gills on its undersides. The gills are lined with dikaryotic cells called basidia. The basidia undergo fertilization to produce diploid cells. The basidia then undergo a process called karyogamy, where each basidium produces a diploid nucleus through nuclear fusion. After karyogamy, the basidia undergo meiosis. Through meiosis, each diploid nucleus yields four haploid nuclei, each of which develops into a basidiospore. Then the cycle begins all over again.